Hey folks, what I have here is uh, a little bit different from my channel. Um, it's going to be a, a mini sort of uh, review slash informational piece about a, a particular lens. The lens in question is this lens. It is a Sigma 2470 EX DG Macro. It doesn't actually say Macro anywhere on it, but it is the Macro version of it. Um, the main thing I want to talk about is the focus speed and just some of the, the odd things about this lens. So let's get straight to the focus speed. I'm going to zoom this to 24mm and you'll see the focus scale here. I'm going to just auto zoom, focus the camera and uh, actually have the lens cap on. So what will happen is it will just rack back and forward um, as fast as it goes. Now this, this lens doesn't have a HSM motor, it has a conventional motor but it's still pretty damn quick as you're about to see. So here we go. So that's from infinity to 0.3 of a meter, 20 centimeters to infinity. So pretty damn quick. Um, odd things about this lens is it zooms backwards so it's quite it's at its longest there at 24mm as you zoom to 60mm it gets to its 65mm about it gets to its shorts and up to 70 it gets a little bit longer um, if I suspend it upside down it's actually not creeping at 24mm there we go. It's not too. It's not too bad. I mean, at seventy, you know, sort of from fifty down to seventy, it will creep a little bit. But at twenty-four mil, it's uh, it's pretty stable. So zoom creep isn't too much of an issue. Um, in terms of uh, focusing manually, you have your conventional switch here. Switch to manual. However, you still can't manually focus with this ring until you also push it down. So now I can control the focusing. So you basically have a dual setup. If you want to go to autofocus, you have to push that and you have to flick this switch. Some people find that annoying. There is a benefit to it though. You have this nice ring, which is free when you're in autofocus. So if you're, if you're holding a light camera like the 400D here and a heavy lens like the 2470 and you're going from normal orientation to portrait shooting you have, can have good support with one hand and you don't have to move your hand to just rotate the camera which is a feature I like but um, it's not one a lot of people pick up on you have your hood you can reverse quite easily your center pinch lens it's a fairly big lens element. Take it off the camera. That's the whole thing. So I'll just show you the focus speed one more time because that's what a lot of people are curious about. Quick, huh? Just one press of the button and release. And just for reference, it doesn't matter where you're zoomed to, but I'll put it on 24mm, do it at the end. Quick. I have a HSM lens here. Which I'll zoom to 24mm. And I'll move to the start and I'll show you how fast 24mm is. And it goes one way for this lens for some reason. If anything, this particular HSM might even be a little bit slower. The main difference obviously with HSM is you've no focus noise and your manual focus works all the time. 
you can override the autofocus at any time. And of course you just have the single switch if you want permanent manual control. So that's it. 2470, big lens, fast focusing. Um, picture quality is fantastic. Even used wide open at f over 2.8. Um, and uh, yeah, if you guys like this sort of video, I'll put up a few more. Thanks for watching.